Hello, what's up, YouTube lovers? It's Ingenious Goldie here again with another very quick one for you guys. You guys know that I love to leave bonus tips. So for today's bonus, guys, I'm going to be telling you the, a very easy way to find out if the product you have in your hands right now or the one you're about to buy or the one you've even used, if they were original. Guys, you don't need to send SMS. You don't need airtime. You don't need an app. You don't need anything. Like, this is super easy and you can do it right now. Guys, if you want to find out this bonus tip, just keep watching, okay? Let's jump into the video. Guys, I just have a new package, like a new routine I'm about to, you know, pick on from my skin. And I decided that, let me just tell you guys about it. Like, let you guys in. So guys, first of all, I want to say I am done. Oh, yes. I am done with um, using random products. You guys know that I usually thought myself as the girl that likes to test products. Like, I don't like being faithful to one product because I'm like, there's so many things on the market. And as I'm buying one, I'm looking at the other and I'm like, ah, this one might be nice too. So I'm just waiting to finish the one I'm with. Ah, why is my video doing that? So I'm just waiting to finish the one that I'm with before I rush and get another one and get another one. And man, it has not favored my skin. Because of trying new stuff, trying new stuff, trying new stuff, guys. I used this cream called Nature Secrets and I made the mistake of applying it on my face as you guys must have seen I have not recorded that review I'll still do that but guys it left white dots on my face legit white dots guys it's my first time having that experience with any skincare products and I'm really sorry for the fluctuation in my lighting I don't know what's possible I don't even know how to fix it so sorry please just endure okay so guys um yes I've never had that experience with any product before why dots? Ah. ah, I'm so disappointed. And then I have to wait it through. It's been like more than more than a month or more since I, you know, stopped applying that. In fact, I applied that cream for just four days on my face, so and it did that thing immediately. So it's been like more than more than a month since I stopped applying, it, and still the white dots are still there. They're not going anywhere. Like it's it's not like I have to pray so that they'll clear. Hey, so guys. I'm seriously done with, you know, using random products, testing new stuff. Now, eh, I want to buy one product. Be faithful to it and just stay with it. Use it for at least one year before I say that I'm going to try anything new. And then again, guys, why I decided to go on this routine is that I know you guys are seeing what I'm going to review. You are seeing it on the table. But it's all right. <laughs> I still come to that. But anyway, guys, uh, why I hopped onto this routine is because I, I was looking at my feet the other day and I was like, man, my feet can be better than this. Like, what the heck is this? If you guys have been following my videos for some time, you must have noted where I talked about a skin problem that I suffered from from a younger age. Guys, I suffered from this skin problem up till the age of 20. In fact, as I'm saying, it's a skin problem I once had. Like, I just have to pause and say, thank you, Father. Thank you. Thank you that it's like, I can say that this skin problem is in the past. But guys, this skin problem, um, I was managing it with um, steroid creams. Um, Skinel, I use Skinel, I use Fumba. They, they were like my life support. <laughs> I can't even explain skin problem to you guys now. Like, I don't even want to get into it. But just know that it was so, so bad that with these steroid creams, like, I can't even go out of the house. I cannot expose my skin. So, yes, they did help me to be clearing my skin, keeping it at, um, you know, at a base that I can, human beings can still look at me. But, you, you know, steroid creams are very dangerous. So imagine being on steroid creams for like 20 years, you know, 19 years, but like it's quite close. So guys, it really destroyed my skin and especially my feet. I have serious hyperpigmentation on my feet. Like my feet are just nothing to write home about. Guys, I'm just going to put a small clip so you guys can see my feet. I've inserted a clip of my feet so you guys can see what I'm saying. As you guys can see, the hyperpigmentation is real. Also, we'll be using this clip to compare my results from this my routine. Take a look at somebody's feet go do. Mm. There's no way I can ignore my feet looking like that. So that's why I decided that I must hop onto this routine. It's quite pricey, but I decided I must do it because there's no any time I look at my feet that I used to be happy with myself. So guys, before I even get to uh, the cocoa, please, oh, if you're seeing my face for the second or third or fourth time, and you, your subscribe button is still red. You never click on. Habba, habba. Please click on the subscribe button. It encourages me. So that I'll know that as I'm, you know, spending my time. Because guys, YouTubing is not easy. You'll be your videographer. You'll be your editor. You'll be your, like, you have to know everything and do everything. Ah, 
after you now post. Somebody will now come. They will not like. They will not comment. Please, oh, subscribe to my channel because it makes me know that you appreciate my work and that you're interested in you know me feeling your presence. Because when you subscribe, that's when I feel that uh, hey, this uh, this is my audience. So guys, please subscribe. Subscribe to encourage my work here on YouTube. Let me continue. I got this idea from two YouTubers that I was watching. Um, skincare. They're also skincare, you know, vloggers. The first one is Mimi Von Snatch. I love that woman so so much. I follow her channel. And um, yes, so uh, I think I'll just leave her link. So if you guys want to check out her channel, you can do that. The second YouTuber, I can't remember her name right now, unfortunately. But they were the ones that I got this this simpler routine from. You know, guys. Um, if you if you are really interested in skincare, you will know that this that chemical exfoliation. Like first of all, exfoliation is just very essential. Like it's something that you should not like. It's something that should not be missing out of your skincare routine. It's just a must. Okay, and then there is physical exfoliation and there is chemical exfoliation. Chemical exfoliation is more beneficial and has more um, it has more effects than what physical exfoliation. So guys, chemical exfoliation is something that normally seems too far for me when they talk about glycolic acid, lactic acid, and all these things. I'm like, ah, oh, it just tires me, and I just feel like I might never get to do these things. But then these two YouTubers recommended. In fact, it's just as if both of them, even as if maybe they watch themselves or something. But then they recommended a very easier way towards chemical exfoliation. And man, I was so happy to hear them say that. Okay, so I decided that instead of just sitting down and looking at my feet that I'm not happy with, you get better for me to just try out this method. It will help me exfoliate my whole body, not just my feet. And so guys, yes, the, the purpose of this routine is to help me exfoliate my skin. Chemical exfoliation. Something doable for, you know, something each and every one of us can do. Instead of glycolic acid and all those other stuff that it seems like it's only conk skincare um, lovers that can get their hands on those stuff. Okay, so... The two products I have with me are... Ta -da! Yes, uh, I even showed you guys the back. Well, come to it. So guys, yes, I have two products with me, which are the recommended products for carrying out a chemical exfoliation routine. And guys, this is not just a one day, a, sorry, a one week or three days something. This is something I'm supposed to do for six to eight weeks. Six to eight weeks, that's like two months. Okay, so that's how I plan to do it. I bought two bars of this soap, which I'm hoping will be enough. I'm not quite sure it's enough, but I hope I hope it's carry me and then this cream. Okay, so um, the purpose of the lotion now, which I'll show you guys, this is fair and white lotion. As you guys can see, is the original. I just tore off the cap now, and this is the back. I scanned the barcode, guys, and. It brought out the original product for me. It brought out their website, Gong Gong. Yeah. See now, I bought it on Jumia. I just opened my package now, so you guys can see. Okay, I will tell you guys what to look out for. But basically, you can already see it. You can see the um, the embossed fair and white, both at the front and the back. You guys can see their barcode. You can see that. You can see that it's, it's um, a 485 ml bottle. And all of that so you can even just take screenshots of this video if you want to get this cream so that you can see that there's um their logo there so if you want to get this cream guys the two ways you can make sure you're getting the original first of all you just go to fair and white website on their website the cream was just like this so i'm very sure it's original so you can go on their website take pictures and then search for it at any store if you're buying it on jumia if you're in nigeria and you want to buy it on jumia i got it for 400 for <laughs> say 400 I wish I got it for 4,700 naira, and when shipping fee and other stuff were added, it came down to 5,400 naira. So that's it. So if you want to get it on Jumia, that should be the price. If you want to get it at local stores, I really don't know the price. For the texture of the cream, the cream is white in color. Cream is white in color, and you can see the texture, and then it's thick, and it smells nice. Like it's just a mouth scent. It smells like baby cream. Okay, um, what I have here, let me now show you guys in detail. This is Koji San Kojic Acid Soup. Again, I just want to show you guys what the original looks like. Mm. You can see there's nothing written here, just half of this woman's face, half of this woman's face at all, as, as well. Then the front, you can see that all that is there is Kojic Acid Soup. The way you can see this, guys, that's the way it's um 
that's where it's embossed on the soap okay let me just open the soap and show you guys so this is it here has only arabic throughout and then the other parts what does it have okay this place has kojisan skin lightening soap and then it has the expiry dates and the batch number so then the back proper now has the ingredients so the ingredients are coconut oil deionized water sodium hydroxide fragrance kojic acid glycerin aqua and xanthan gum and etc okay and it was made in the philippines and then there's the barcode so um let me just open up the soap and show you guys the inside just like so you know again what an original koji stand looks like so this is it you can see the koji koji acid soap um you know embossed on the body and then all around the wrap you just see koji stand koji stand and original you know there is a word here original so yeah if you're getting your soap you should look like this um and this is 100 135 gram written at the back 135 gram of soap that's the one that has this um this embossed you know logo and the um what do i call it now watermark on the pack so any other smaller size doesn't have it okay and guys you get this soap for 1000 naira or even higher but the actual price is 1000 naira it doesn't stink okay um yeah it's it's it doesn't stink i was surprised but it doesn't stink it's mild and even on the website they say that it doesn't stink and that thing is that it doesn't really have a citrusy smell it doesn't have this wonderful scent like some um soaps do so if you buy your own and it has you know i like telling you guys how to know original so that you not go and buy fake and come and say something funny okay so if you buy your own and it's smelling very very nice you know ah this is not, it's not the original that you have it <laughs> okay So guys, yes, the tip I talked about earlier is tip for scanning the barcode, yes. So guys, you don't need another app to scan this your barcode. All you have to do is, if you have an Android phone, mm, a smartphone that has Google installed, it means that you have your Google Assistant. So all you have to say is, hey Google, and Google will answer. <sighs> Sorry guys, I was interrupted. When I said the Google word, she answered me without knowing I'm just making a video. So anyway, when you say that word, I don't want to say before Google will answer again, she answers, then you ask her to scan a barcode for you, then she'll bring out Google Lens, then you scan the barcode, just, um, you know, set the, set the camera to scan the barcode, click on the search button, immediately it will bring, once you have an internet connection, it will bring out the um, appropriate website, so you can know if it brings out the the products or um the products actual manufacturer websites then you know that you have an original product if it doesn't you know that you have a fake product and so on and so forth so that's just one way i found very convenient for scanning barcode and i just wanted to let you guys know if you like the barcode tip that i drop for you guys whenever i have bonus that's how i'll be dropping it so please if you're not subscribed please subscribe okay and if you've not liked this video please like this video if you've been on this type of um if you've been on this type of routine before please comment tell me how it went okay tell me what you think about this process um if you've used any of these products before also let me know because i like to know what you know i like to draw experience and ideas from people so please don't keep your own to yourself and then people others that come to this video might get a thing or two from the comment section from you as well so if you're going to hop on this routine with me please don't go and mix it with something just use it the way it is and this they don't tell me it's not like name you and blah 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 if you're going to up on this routine it's an exfoliation routine we're not expecting our skin to look you know fairer or anything like that after this routine no it's just to help exfoliate the skin so that whatever products i use afterward i'll be able to get maximum benefits from it so that's the reason for this process and we're doing it for this long so that you know we can get the maximum benefits from it okay apply leave on your skin for three minutes rinse off then you know take your shower then sorry then rinse off your body then you come out and you use this this baby here, that's the best way to get, you know, benefits from your soap. Instead of just washing it and rinsing it immediately, just allow it to sit on your skin for three minutes, then rinse. Please don't do this in the daytime. Don't use any of these products in the daytime because they are anti-sun, like they hate sun. Okay, so put them and sun, they don't cross paths. So you should just use it in the night. If you're not going to be exposed to the sun, use morning and night. If you're going to be exposed to the sun, use only in the night, only in the night every day. Okay, so yes. Lactic acid helps for chemical exfoliation and that is why I am using this cream in particular. That's why I'm not just using any cream. Okay? There's a reason why it is this particular cream or the Amlactin. Another cream you can use like in place of this one is the Amlactin. I'm going to leave the picture 
But the reason why I don't go for that um, lactin is because it's way costlier than this one. So this one is very much affordable and I'll be able to, you know, get my hands on lactic acid lotion and I'll be able to get the benefits. So I was very, very happy that Fair and White have their own lactic acid lotion and it's also a recommended one. But if you feel like you have some more box, um, that um, lactin has a lot of wonderful reviews so you can also use that one. But these two creams, guys, they have lactic acid and they help with chemical exfoliation so after six to eight weeks i'll know that my skin has been exfoliated very very well okay then i can use another cream after one month i'm going to tell you guys how it's going so far what i've noticed and all of that so you guys can just be kept in the loop that's it for today guys i hope i really hope you enjoyed the video please if you did um make sure to like my video thanks for watching and keep watching us for ingenious goldie for more content from me yeah bye